Hi, welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we're going to look at complementary angles. Okay, complementary are two angles that add to 90 degrees. So x plus y is equal to 90, or the first angle, angle 1, plus the measure of angle 2 is equal to 90. So the measures of the angles add up to 90 degrees. So let's look at these relationships. Um, if angle 1 is represented by 2x and angle 2 is represented by 3x, what are the measures, uh, what's the value of x? Well, if we're told they're complementary, we're just going to add those two angles up to a sum of 90 degrees. So that's 2x plus 3x. That gives me 5x is equal to 90. And 5 goes into 90, let's see, 1... 18 times. So x is 18 and that's how we define 18. Now if you were asked to find the measure of angle 1, we would just plug 18 in to 2x and we would get 36 and we would, if we needed to find the measure of angle 2, we would plug 18 into 3x and we would get 54. And you can kind of double check that. What's 36 plus 54? Well those add to 90 so that is correct. Okay, let's look at a second one. The measure of angle 1 is x. The measure of angle 2 is x plus 20. Well, if they're complementary, we're going to add those two angles up to 90 degrees. So we have x plus x plus 20 is equal to 90, because that's angle 1 and angle 2. That gives us 2x plus 20 is equal to 90. Now to solve that equation, you're going to subtract 20 from both sides. So you're going to get 2x is equal to 70. And now you're going to do inverse operations. You're going to divide by 2. And you get x is equal to 35 degrees. And that is how you find the value of x. Okay, let's look at the next one. Okay, angle 1 is equal to 2 times the measure of angle 2. Well, angle 2 is equal to x. So if angle 2 is equal to x, and we know that the measure of angle 1 is equal to twice angle 2, the measure of angle 1 is going to equal 2 times the measure of angle 2. So that means the measure of angle 1 is just 2x. So now I have 2x plus x is equal to 90, so 3x is equal to 90, divide by 3, and x must be 30. So that means 30 is angle 2, and 2 times 30, which would be 60, would be angle 1. And that works out because those both add to 90. Okay, let's look at this last one. The measure of angle 1 is 30 plus x. The measure of angle 2 is 40 plus x. We know they're complementary, so at this point we know we're going to add them up to 90 degrees. Now let's add our like terms, 30 plus 40, that's 70. x plus x, that's going to add to 2x's. So 2x plus 70 is equal to 90. Let's subtract 70. So 2x is equal to 20. And x, dividing both sides by 2, is equal to 10. So that's the value of x when we're solving for complementary angles. So let's just summarize. When you're trying to find the sum of two angles that are complementary, you're going to add them up to 90 degrees. Thank you for watching Moo Moo Math, and don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>